Alright guys, he's in here. Welcome back to the channel for another Street Fighter Duel video. So in this one, I might talk about this event, right? Let me just collect this stuff first, right? So, go oh, collect you, collect you, um, well, I mean, I suppose I could level up you. I'll decide what other one I'm going to level up later. Um, yeah, so this event, it's really weird, like, it's super weird. I don't really get what's going on. This could just be my dumb brain not allowing me to figure out what's going on but yeah i don't get it right so first of all big shout out to bakar 014 and um, you beat me congratulations i should have woke up earlier this morning to put in more than one run and maybe maybe with a bit of luck i could have got up there but it, the, it doesn't the game does not make sense to me it, do, it, it doesn't make sense right so i'm just going to look at a couple of things right so if we look here right 356 multiplier, 274 multiplier, 320 multiplier. The units used, right? Final score, 2697884020, right? There's an S plus unit, an A unit in there. Now if we look at mine, so 290, higher multiplier. 340. So within the range, 406. So overall, I would say that I've got more score multipliers. I've got really strong units. I don't understand how I didn't win. I don't. I don't get this event. I don't understand. I, I don't understand it. Like, there's no reason that this. Ken should last any length of time, right? Because when I've used Ken, have I got him in a team here? No, I took him out of a team. When I used Ken, he got chewed through like butter, right? He just absolutely melted, right? I mean, obviously it could be workbench, right? Can we see, can we see workbench? I don't think we can see workbench, can we? I don't think we can see workbench. No, we can't see workbench, right? But at the end of the day, everyone's using pretty much the same thing on the workbench, right? Unless you've got decent crit rate and crit rate damage, and probably speed, for especially for Nero, you're not going to do much scores, right? So, I'm going to go out on a limb here, and I'm going to assume that if we look at the workbench, their workbench wouldn't have been too dissimilar to mine. Like, I reckon they would have been using this one because... You need, you need to use this one. For Blanca, this is the one to be using, right? It's going to give you really good scores, right? You've got these ones here, giving you the crit rate and crit rate damage. Vital to have them, plus they're giving you speed. He's using a lot of wind units, so I wouldn't be shocked if they're using this one here. Maybe, maybe not. This one's maybe up for debate. This could have been one that was different, but I don't see what really could have been that different that would elevate S plus and a units to outscore SSS plus 5 units by so much. I mean, I think it's awesome that free to play or dolphin or whatever the category a player is, I think it's awesome that they can compete in events like this, but I just find it weird that I can't figure out how. You know, it's like, I know that this multiplier thing isn't actually a multiplier, right? I've known this for a while, I've been talking about it with Dom and stuff like that on the um, on the Discord, so I, I'm, I'm just throwing out names and if you guys don't know who I'm talking about I apologise, but it's just other content creators. Um, but basically, with relation to this, Don, he is a, a Twitch streamer who is a content creator and he plays this game and he's got quite a decent brain for figuring out how stuff works and um, I've also spoken to a couple of other players on like the community feedback page on the discord and stuff like that and essentially when you look at the quillo path and you look at the this point multiplier thing it'd be better being called something like points percentage given right something weird like that because it's not a multiplier it's like to get your true score you have to apply this and anything you don't apply debuffs your score so it doesn't multiply your score it more penalizes your score so 
it should be more like if you don't use any of these it's point penalty 100 if you have on half point penalty 50 if you have on three quarters point penalty 25 then that way you know that you are going to sometimes be better off just running a team with less penalties like so how to explain this in a better way because what I just said there was absolute fucking gibberish right what I mean is let's just say it presented it as a, a penalty right so if we look at this this one here I'm not going to save this right so let's let's just say for example right that's everything switched on that would say point penalty zero right so if I ran that team and let's just say I got 10 million points right 10 million points with a point penalty of zero right let's say I took off this one and I took off this one right and what that would do is that would give me a point penalty of 25 right but I could score 50 million right I would know straight away that I would actually be better off taking the point penalty and running the team that could score 50 million than having on all of this stuff and taking the zero penalty and having my full score. So I think they need to change, if they ever do it again, this wording, right? I think they need to change the wording. I think they need to be more clear and let us know what percentage of the points we would lose rather than calling it a multiplier because at that stage we would then be able to make I want to say a lot more informed choices about our team builds because again that team that I showed you that that beat me again congratulations on beating me for me it might have just been as simple as if we go back to the teams I was using if I can get out of here we go back to Nero it might have just been as simple as on this team rather than taking a point multiplier of 406 and only getting I think it was like 70 million I think that was right yeah 70 million or something like that right something weird like that anyway instead of getting that it might have been better for me to reduce that down score 150 million get a greater penalty but I would have walked away with a higher score in fairness I should have experimented with that right but I didn't have a lot of time left it was like last thing I had like 10 minutes before the event ended um, so I didn't really have enough time to mess about any longer but if it just clearly said point penalty equals this then straight away just looking at it you can see exactly what it's going to be and it would make it easier for team building for experimenting for trying new things um, and I just think it would be ultimately a much better way to go to be completely honest um, but anyway the event's weird it's fun but it's weird I just wish they would not call it a multiplier because a multiplier implies whatever your score is will have an amount an addition to that score whereas the reality is it doesn't it takes away from your score so that's not a multiplier it's a penalty and they should really say that because by saying that it makes things a lot clearer and we know what we're doing simple simple as anyway that's enough morning hazing out